What's good guys, if you guys want the most cheap and most reliable EAFC24 coins, make sure you guys check out u7buy.com on making that team better. Also, if you guys ever want to make a purchase, make sure you guys use the code DAN to get 6% off on making that team better. If you guys ever want to sell your EAFC24 coins, go to the same website and go to the selling section as well. Yo YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel, yeah boys. And the moment of truth is finally here. A highly requested video from a lot of y'all folks. And today we're gonna go ahead and review that 95 rated Future Stars icon Ronaldinho. Looking absolutely insane. We're looking at a card's 5'11 on the height, high medium work rates, five star skill moves, four star weak foot with that right foot. Acceleration type is controlled explosive, 94 pace, 91 shooting. 94 passing, 90 dribbling, 84 physicality as well. Finesse shot, chip shot, dead ball, long ball pass, flare, technical travella, and the two play styles on plus are trickster and quick step as well. Now, Dino is looking very broken. There's a lot of camp styles you could give him. We want to max out the shooting, in my opinion. You give him the nice hot chemistry style. You max out that pace. Acceleration goes up to 99. Sprint speed goes up to 97. Pretty much maxed out right there. Finishing 98, shot power and long shots goes up to 98. Attack position goes up to 95. And you boost up the physicality as well because we all know Ronaldinho in FIFA has kind of a thick body type where he doesn't lose the ball easily. So strength goes up to 94, aggression goes up to 79. Ronaldinho is going to be playing with this team right here. Shout out to the homie Dobby for lending us the account so we can review this big boy card that's currently over 14 million coins. Which is insane, but he's going to be playing as a right forward in the 4-3-2-1 formation. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I was a huge fan of that Thunderstruck Ronaldinho. One of the best cards in the game. 1,000% a top 2 to top 3 winger still. Now we got the Future Stars Icon version. We want to see if there's a major difference. And if that price gap justifies the major price difference. Because let's be honest, man. He has a lot of hype around him. We're going to play these games in foot champs. And see how good this card is. All right, here we go with game number one. Finally, our opponent's name is Jera Bops 14. All right, all right. Hopefully, it's a meta team. Backline's pretty good. Midfield is okay. That attack is very mid, but it is what it is. Has a pen created. All right, we do take that first play of the game. We're going to go ahead and shoot it with the man himself. Going to go ahead and go top right. Good finish, nice. Very nice pass to Dino. Nice left stick dribbling and a oh, terrible miss. That's tough. Very nice on the step over. Keeps onto the ball and that time with a beautiful finish inside the box. Speed already looking amazing on the card. Dino with the rig. Yeah, Kim and Jay, you're not going to be able to catch up to him. Unfortunately, I did take an extra touch there. Near post. That time he puts in the back end. That good stuff. We go with Dino versus Kim Min Jay. My goodness, this card is absolutely quick. Oh, that's a beautiful pass. Test out that weak foot and a good finish with that weak foot. Good stuff. Find him on the inside. Test out that weak foot once again. It's a little bit unlucky, unlucky, unlucky. Bruh. I don't understand this game. I do not understand this game. Dino misses a clear open chance. Inside the box with the weak foot, but bangs that in outside the box. Little pass it back post and beautiful. Defense leading to the assist and a great tap in from Dino. Very nice and step over. Cooks Davies. Oh my goodness. Oh my fucking goodness. Even him moving the goalkeeper, Daniel was still able to score that. 
amazing dribbling so far. Damn, this guy actually moved the goalkeeper pretty nicely. I don't think he's offside. Little shot cancel. Cook the goalkeeper right there. Good composure from Dino. Trying to find them. Takes the ball away from VVD. And that is a pen. Yeah, I believe that's a pen. Gonna go ahead and shoot it with the man himself. Top of left. Hopefully we don't miss this. Oof, what a finish. Very nice finish. Nice low driven from Dino and good ball control as expected. That was nice. That was beautiful. I'm lucky on that miss, man. Very nice, man. He's just, he's super, super quick. He reminds me like Mbappe, honestly, with the step overs and the quickness. Very nice finish with the weak foot. Something that hasn't been perfect this video. I mean, it's pretty consistent, but we need to test it out a little bit more. Very nice. Far post and a beautiful finish. Good positioning as well from Dino. Very nice, beautiful little fake shot inside the box and a good finish as well. What a ball. Little Travella, nice and easy, man. It's just so easy with this card. Nice, keeps the ball past VVD. Test out that weak foot. Beautiful finish with that four star weak foot. Things you love to see. That's the Dino I'm talking about. Nice finish for our post, man. Once he gets that initial step over, no catching up to the card. All right, boys, and that concludes the review for 95 rated future stars icon Ronaldinho coming around extinct by the time I'm recording this video on all platforms. That is just absolutely crazy. Now, we played seven games with the card, 17 goals, and zero assists as a right forward in a 4 3 2 1 formation. Now, I'm not going to go ahead and sit here and say, is this card meta? Is this card nice? Obviously, he's one of the best cards in the game. Top two winger in the game, in my opinion. Locked with that team of the year Mbappe. Arguably a top five card in general. You know, you got that team of the year R9. You got that team of the year Mbappe. You got team of the year Van Dyke. Whether you value a center back a lot in today's game. And you got other players along the lines. Like that Mia Hamm team of the year, Johan Cruyff. This Ronaldinho makes that argument for being a top five card in the game. You know, everything works with this card. High medium work rates, amazing work rates, five star skill moves. Who doesn't love an attacker with five star skill moves? Now the four star weak foot is actually not bad. It's not on the same level as a team of the year CR7 or a team of the year Mbappe four star weak foot. I would probably put it as the third best four star weak foot in the video game. But still, that is pretty impressive. He has 91 shooting specifically. 94 finishing going up to 98. Didn't miss one or two opportunities. You know, I don't expect a car that's extinct on the market or worth 14 million coins to miss any single chance. But let's be honest, that's just EA being garbage with the gameplay. You know, sometimes they make the best possible players miss clear cut chances. As surprising as that might sound, and that's something I don't like to see from a car worth this much. But I'm gonna go ahead and have to deal with that. But aside from that, everything works on the car dribbling. Dribbling is actually amazing. His stepovers are arguably tied best in the game with that team of the year Mbappe. I'm not even kidding. Then you combine that with that quick step on plus, 98 agility, 96 reactions, 98 ball control, 98 dribbling. Boys, the stepovers on this card are going to be a problem. If you're going against this card, you better guard them stepovers. You better back up defensively because no matter which CB you have, except if it's team of the year Van Dyke, you're not going to be able to catch up to this Dino at all. This offensive AI, absolutely one. 91 attack position going up to 95. Always at the right spot at the right moment. Passing is top tier as well. He's able to pass for either foot with that 95 short pass, 96 vision. But the thing that separates this Dino from those other cards that are smaller and agile like Messi and Pele is the physicality. This Dino has 86 strength going up to 90. 
71 aggression going up to 79 and i can appreciate how physical this dino is you know not only is he quick but if you have a cb trying to body off dino he's gonna hold his own he's gonna be able to hold his own and not lose the ball easily so that's something i did like from this dino now this is probably something that a lot of people are not gonna want to hear but there's not much of a difference between this 95 dino and the 94 thunderstruck and what i mean by that it's not a seven mil difference yes Obviously, the Future Stars version is better. You do notice a difference, but it's not a major difference, you know? So if you're somebody that has the 94 tradable and you're thinking of selling that version to get the Future Stars, unless you have like 50 million or 30 million coins on your account, I would not go out of my way to buy the Future Stars Dino. I would just keep the Thunderstruck and you're gonna be chilling until at least team of the season. But you guys let me know in the comment section down below for those of you guys if anybody was able to pack or buy this Future Stars Dino, what do you guys think about the card? Do you guys think he's the best player in EFC 24 Ultimate Team? Or do you guys think players like R9 Team of the Year and Bappa Team of the Year, Mia Ham Team of the Year are still better than this Future Stars Dino? This card is obviously going to get a thumbs up for me and he's going to get a rating of a perfect 10 out of 10. Yeah, boys. Absolutely insane. And whoever does acquire this card, you are indeed one lucky person. Thank you guys so much for supporting all the videos. You guys are amazing. I don't know what's the next video going to be. I think the next video I'm going to drop is going to be a player review from Future Stars team number two. I heard the team number two is coming. I don't know if that's true or not, but we'll have to see. Very close to 7,000 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for support. If you guys are enjoying the FIFA content, feel free. Drop a quick subscription and like. Very nice to see the support on the channel recently. Till next time, it's been your boy Dan FIFA and I am out. Bye-bye.